Well, how's it going guys? Welcome back to another creek fishing adventure today. As you can see right here, we're at this little creek and there are fish everywhere. I mean, this water is crystal, crystal clear. It doesn't get much more clear than this. And it's like an aquarium. There's fish swimming everywhere, trout. And uh, I got my little ultralight rod with a curly tail grub and a jig head. And we're gonna make it happen, that's all you need. I just brought a few jig heads, some curly tails, threw them in my back pocket and uh, you're good to go. All right, guys, so I gotta be super, super stealthy. I mean, with water this clear, once the fish see you, they're not gonna bite. So I gotta be super, super careful. I mean, as much as I can be, there's not a whole lot you can do. Let's give it a first cast of the day. First cast, oh, I think I just spooked them all. Oh, oh, oh my goodness. Stay down, stay down, stay down. I just got crushed. I had like six or seven fish follow it in. Look, they're just staged up right there, not moving. Watch this. Come get it, buddy. Oh, oh, oh. I got him. Got him. Get over here. Don't spook the other ones. Look at that. Crystal clear water. Beautiful. Looks like a little splake. Look at that. <laughs> there we go. Check that out. Beautiful, beautiful splake. Decent sized one, nice, fat, and healthy. Crush that little curly tail. We might have to keep this dude. Hooked him in kind of a bad spot right in the gill. Yeah, we're definitely gonna keep this guy. He's bleeding, he's hooked in, a gill, in the gills. First little catch of the day, he's gonna be dinner. Probably gonna keep another one, but that is a beautiful, beautiful fish. Great way to start the day. All right, they're all still out there. There's still tons of fish out there. Hopefully I didn't spook them too bad. Oh, there's a follow. Oh, missed him. Got him, got him. Came right over. Oh, darn. <laughs> got off. Got him. That's a good fish. That's a good fish. I mean, this isn't a huge fish, but he's fighting hard. Oh, get out of those willows, buddy. Get out of those willows. There's lots of junk in here that I could break off on. Wow, that's actually not a bad fish. There we go. Look at that. That is a nice fish, actually. Not a bad size fish at all. Another splake. Beautiful, beautiful fish. Look. Oh, he got him on the underside of the mouth there. Let him go. Oh, okay. <laughs> he was uh, not happy. Got me wet. He got his revenge. Oh. Who? Oh, golly. They are all over this little grub. Man, they are like starving or something. Holy cow. Oh, got him, got him. What is that? Oh, he's going crazy, he's going crazy. Look at those jumps. Whoa, calm down, bud, calm down, calm down. Calm down. What is that, what is that? That is, what is that? Yeah, it's a tiger trout, look at that. Look at that. Calm down, friend, calm down, look at that. Long and skinny tiger trout. Crazy, crazy. Nice. On that little white grub. Just get him back. Very next cast. That's a good fish. That's actually a good fish. Very next cast. Oh my gosh. They fight so hard. Holy cow. Hey, 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 get out of there. Don't you even think about it. Yes, look at that. That looks like dinner to me. Yeah, we're gonna keep this guy. So we have our two fish I'm gonna keep. I'm only gonna keep two, uh, but I'm gonna keep fish and see what else we can catch. But there we go, that is so much fun. Oh, oh, no, 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 oh. Oh, you've got to be kidding me, dude. 
man, I loosened my grip for one second and he's just gone. Well, that's all right, I guess. Not a big deal. There we go. Oh, that's a good one. That's a good one. That's bigger than the last one. That's bigger than the last one. Oh, he's gonna tangle me up big time if he goes over there. Nope, 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 nope. Oh, shoot. He's gonna tangle me up. Just swim out there, swim out there. Yep. There we go. That is a good one. Look at that tiger. Oh, my goodness. No, 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 no. No. Look at. Oh, wow. Well, that was a giant. What is going on, folks? What's going on? There's some fish. There's some more fish, tons of fish right here. Look at that. Look at that. Watch this. Watch this. We're gonna get him right here. Yep, yep, oh. Oh, missed him, missed him, missed him. Got him, got him, got him. Got him right there. Got him, got him. Oh, look at that. Look at that. Nice little fish on the curly tail. Let that guy go. Just right out there in the middle underneath all these trees. There's probably a hundred fish. Oh, oh, they're swiping at it. They're swiping at it. That's a good fish. Oh, man. Got him. Oh, wait, did I have him? Oh! Ow, oh, ow, ouch, ouch. That fish just set the hook into my cheek. Or my jaw. Ooh, that could have been worse. Ouch, that actually hurt. All right, let's try that again. Got him, there we go. There we go. Ooh, is that an eater? That might be an eater, folks. Yep, 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 yep. Perfect, perfect keeper right there. Nice. Look at that. Beautiful, beautiful tiger. So we have a splake and a tiger we're gonna cook up. All right, so I just knocked him out. So he is no longer with us. We'll just set him off to the side. And we'll put him in the cooler in a second, but see if I can get one of those big boys cruising out there. Come on. Oh, wow. Something just knocked it, or one of those fish just got him, got him. Oh, this is just a baby. What do we have here? Ooh, look at that. New species. A little brown trout. Look at that. Look at that. Nice. Nice. That guy just tore off my tail on my curly tail. I'm going to go ahead and try out this little pink crawfish uh, imitation. I don't think they eat crawfish in here, but I think they'll hit just about anything at this point. Got him. Oh, that's a good one. Oh, look at that. That's a good fish. Whoa, 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 oh shoot, oh shoot, oh shoot, oh shoot. He's tangled up in this tree. Oh, there we go, there we go. Oh, look at that. Do not get off, bud. Do not get off. Do not get off. Oh, 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 look at that. <laughs> Holy freaking cow. I hooked him. He went crazy. I literally couldn't catch up to him. Swam around this tree and almost got broke off or tangled up. I honestly don't know how the heck I landed this fish. What a beautiful fish. On that little pink crawdad imitation looking thing. Well guys, I was just walking up the creek here and look what I spotted. Check that out. A little two-point antler just right underneath this cedar tree. Not only are we catching fish, but we're finding sheds while we're at it. 
Dude, doesn't get much better than that. I just love fishing little creeks like this because you never know what can happen. Here we are. Let's try right here. Oh, here, here. Oh, oh. Come on, bite it. There we go. That's a good one. That's a good fish. That's a good fish. <sighs> Look at that. Look at that. Oh, gosh. <laughs> Woo -hoo. The reason I don't have my net is because I was expecting to catch little baby trout. I had no idea I was going to be catching fish this size. So forgive me. Just lift him up. Look at that beautiful, beautiful tiger. Another stud. Can't get enough of these fish. Found another white curly tail because that seemed to get the most bites. Here we go. Another thing with little creeks like this where there's so many trees and obstacles, you gotta kinda become an expert at casting. I'm not bragging, but I mean, you gotta be able to flip a little jig underneath all these trees with no problems. Got them. There we go. Oh, there he goes, quick catch and release. And if you are gonna fish small little creeks like this, bring plenty of tackle because trust me you're gonna lose quite a bit to the trees there we go instant instant another little tiger i love the fight they put up on this little ultralight there's a little guy we can just lift him up Got him. Man, they hit it so hard, they knock slack in my line that I can't even feel it. It's interesting how some tiger trout are bright orange and some are black and white like this. Another tiger. There we go. Oh! <laughs> oh, flips me right off in the tree. There we go. There we go. That's a decent one. That's a decent one. Oh, I'll say that's a decent one. Staying down. Look at that. Ooh. Whoa, 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 whoa. Holy cow, holy cow. Whoa, 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 whoa. Get out of there, get out of there, get out of there. Oh, shoot, 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 shoot. Oh, he's in that tree. Oh, there we go. I mean, look at that. <laughs> that is seriously like a two pound tiger trout, maybe even bigger, probably about 17 inches. Absolute stud out of this little creek. All right, get back, bud. Man, these fish are so aggressive that I'll reel it in and they'll just follow behind it and then I'll just let it fall in the mud and just let it sit in the mud for a couple seconds and they'll still just come up to it and suck it in. I think there's just so many fish in here and there's not enough food that they're just willing to hit anything. I mean, I honestly think these fish are starving. So, I mean, taking a couple like we did can actually be really, really beneficial to the ecosystem. It leaves a lot more food for the fish that remain so they can grow bigger. The crazy thing is I haven't even fished very much of this creek. I've fished a total of probably 30 yards and we've already caught that many fish. Oh, dude, they're insane. Oh my gosh. I'm literally dipping this little jig in and they're just going nuts. I swear these fish are starving. Whoa, 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 whoa. Dude, I wasn't even paying attention. I was looking over there. That scared the crap out of me. Here's another splake. There we go, beautiful, beautiful fish. Looks like he's been caught before. He's got a little hole in the side of his mouth. There we go, buddy. Oh, <clears throat> dude, look at him right there. Look at him right there. Look at him, watch, 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 watch. Come back for it, come back for it, come back for it. There we go. Oh, nuts, that was a good one. Oh, there goes a beaver. 
you guys definitely can't see it but there's a beaver over there hey quit making well, actually keep keep doing your thing because it's making for great fishing keep building dams i appreciate it all right so we're back at that other spot we're gonna see if we can get a couple more a couple more biggins oh i just cast it right over that tree There we go. That's a good one. There we go. Oh, man. Hey, hey, hey. Nice. Sweet. There we go. Oh, there you go. All right guys, it's cooking time. As you can see, it's gotten a lot darker. I've been fishing for the past couple hours just off camera. I walked upstream, caught a few little small fish, so I figured I wouldn't even record it. I've got my two trout right here that I caught earlier today. Already cleaned them out. We're gonna go ahead and get my propane stove out and get to cooking these fish. First thing, we'll start off with some butter. Get out. There we go. Yeah. I have here some Sportsman's Warehouse seafood shrimp and salmon rub. I think this is primarily used for smoking, but we're just gonna season them with it today. Ooh. Take our splake, season him up. Now we'll go ahead and take him and set him right in there. Ooh. Let's go ahead and flip him. Oh, look at that golden brown skin. Mm -mm -mm. Take the skin away. Look at that. Ooh, look at that. Get some butter on it. Mmm, beautiful pink meat. Kind of an interesting flavor. It's kind of sweet. Seafood shrimp and salmon rub. It's good, but it's kind of sweet. And I don't, I don't really know how I feel about that. Mm -hmm. A little salt. All right, here's some of the tiger trout. The meat's not as pink. It's actually pretty white. I have no idea why, but... It tastes pretty good. I mean, look at the difference in the meat color. The tiger trout is super, super white. The splake is super, super orange. They both taste really good, but they do taste different. Mmm. I do like the splake better. Pink meat on a trout is... Definitely, it just, it tastes better. I don't know why two fish that came from the same body of water have different color of meat. I mean, they're eating the same thing. I guess it is a species thing or just a genetics thing. Either way, they're both really good. Well guys, that's gonna do it for today's video. Hope you enjoyed. I'm gonna head out of here. I've had a great day out here. Caught tons of fish, tons of big fish too. I did not expect fish of that size to be coming out of here, but hey, I'm not complaining. I know you guys like the creek fishing video, so definitely be on the lookout for more. Spring is here, guys. It is officially here. 
and fishing is going to start heating up as you just saw today. So, But if you guys like this video, give it a thumbs up and subscribe if you haven't already. I would really appreciate it. Other than that, I'm going to head out of here. Thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you next time.